she was an old soul. She was funny. She was giving. She was caring. You know, her one of her best friends was 65 years old. And helping others while coping with a personal tragedy. That's exactly what a mother's doing after her nine-year-old daughter was killed in a drinking and driving accident. The emotions are still raw for Olivia Watson's family. That accident happened in March. Today, family and friends are celebrating her life and have a message they want everyone to hear. 27 First News Weekend anchor Julie Bursick is live in the studio with the story. Yeah, kind and caring. That's how Livia Watson's mom described her little girl, but everyone called her Livy. Livy lived in South Carolina, but her parents have ties here to the valley. And today they were in town to honor their little girl. The color purple just about everywhere you look. Shirts, balloons, flowers, even a splash of purple on this truck. Purple was Livy's favorite color. She was our life. She really was. Livy's grandmother was planning to move to South Carolina to be with her girl. But those plans changed on March 26, 2017. Livy was killed in an accident. It happened instantly. So she was on the side of the road. You know, my daughter was gone. I looked at her and realized she's my only biological child. And she was my whole world. So literally at that moment, I died with her. Jolie was hurt in the accident too. She says a drunk driver was going 103 miles per hour and hit her car from the back in South Carolina. Shortly before the accident, Jolie says Livy said something that stuck with her. And it maybe like a half hour, she told me there was an angel in the car. Jolie says she had a choice to make. She could be depressed or she could live for her daughter. That's when she created Living for Livy, a Facebook group encouraging people to spread love, kindness and forgiveness. Jolie says she forgives the person accused of killing her daughter. I can't go to bed every night asking God to forgive me for my sins and protect my baby in heaven when I'm not doing his job here. Family and friends celebrated Livy at the Struthers Parade, spreading that message of love and forgiveness. Livy's mom also wants to remind everyone, don't drink and drive. It's not worth it. I, people, you know, you figure you could have a drink or two or four. It, you know, you, you don't think it's going to happen until it happens to you. The family tells us all the community support means so much to them. And seeing just so many people show up today to spread Livy's message in that parade, what well, means the world to them. Reporting in the studio, Julie Bursick, WKBN 27 First News at 6.